Hi, my name is Nikki. I'm a complementary therapist here in Action Cancer. So we are going to do a lovely, gentle breathing technique. So if you find yourself in a nice, comfortable position, preferably on a chair with your back feeling nicely supported and your spine straight and your feet on the ground. And take a little moment here to get comfortable and to take your time to just feel nicely supported and feel the shoulders if they need adjusting. Get yourself nice and comfy. And we'll just start with placing our hands gently on our chest heart area. And we'll just follow our natural breath and tune into our breath as it goes in and out. There's no need to change your breath here. Just take a, a, a moment to be aware of your own natural breath. So lovely breath in. Feeling the rise of the chest. And on the breath out, feeling the fall of the chest. Feeling the warmth of the hands. And the rise and the fall of the chest. Tuning in with our own, our own breathing. Going at your own pace. And your breathing may be at a different pace and slower than mine and that's, you just go, we just go with our own natural. What feels comfortable. If you feel at any time that you're holding your breath or you feel you're not getting enough breath, then again, just come out of it, just the shoulders. And just tune into the sensation of the hands on the chest. Rising up and down. And then take one hand and just placing it then on the belly area, the abdomen area. And only if it feels comfortable, on the next breath in, see if you can follow that breath. Going in, deep down, down towards the belly, as if the belly was pushing out onto your hand. As if it was a big inflatable balloon or football and it's going out towards a hand. And then on the breath out, feel that belly coming back in towards the body as if it was rising up towards the ribs. And we'll do a few of these because if we're not used to doing the belly type of breathing, it can feel a little bit unusual to start off with. So take your time and just play around with it and see what feels comfortable. And I like to breathe in through the nose and then out slightly through the mouth as if I was blowing bubbles or candles, but equally in through the nose and out through the nose is a lovely way as well to breathe. Again, whatever feels comfortable for you. So a lovely breath in. Feeling the belly expand onto the hand. And when you're ready, your breath out. Feeling that belly come in towards the body, in towards the ribs. And just like we did, feeling the rise and the fall of the chest, we feel the rise of the belly on the in-breath, out towards the hand, and the fall of it coming back in towards the body. And when you've finished the last one, you feel comfortable on the last in and out breath of that, we'll just place our hands, palms up, nice and comfortable on our thighs. And on the next breath in, 
Raise one of those arms up. And then a breath out, placing that hand just gently on the opposite shoulder. And the breathing here can go deeper or slower, or just again your own natural breath. Whatever feels comfortable, following your own pace. And we do the same with the other arm. Lovely breath in. And then a breath out, placing it gently on the opposite shoulder. And again, lovely breath in, hand up. And breath out gently on the shoulder. Breath in, the hand up, and then the breath out, nicely comfortable back on the thigh. You can play away around with this breathing technique. So the next time the hand goes on the shoulder, if you have if you don't have any neck problems, then you can gently turn that neck to look at the hand so you can see your hand and again if there's no neck problems just slowly turning the neck towards the hand and then turning it back to the center with the rise of the hand And again, and this time then when the hand gently touches the shoulder, you can bring in how it feels on there as well. Does your hand feel warm, tingly, cold? Just tuning into your sensations, maybe even each finger or the temperature. Does it feel warm, cold, tingly? You may feel nothing and that's okay too, but you're just tuning in to any sensations. And you're bringing that in with the breath as well, a lovely breath in and out. And I find when I'm doing that a few times that my breath naturally slows down. I naturally want to slow it down and I just follow my own pace. And you do the same. I like to then, whenever I feel that I've done enough and I can feel everything slowing down, can feel myself getting calmer, that I like to end it on a lovely hug, a bit of a hug, um, or just feeling the touch of the arms, of the sensation. It's nice and soothing. just stroking down the arms, finishing maybe on the fingers, and it just soothes, soothes the nervous system and just helps us to feel, feel a little bit calmer and centered. And who doesn't need a hug these days? Okay. And even doing that in the morning can really help can just help to set ourselves up for the day. Um, but you can do that any time of the day, whenever you feel that you need it, just to tune in with yourself and feel you need to just center yourself. And you may want to finish then after that, how we started then with our own natural breath, tuning in to the rise in the fall 
off the chest with the breath. Okay. I hope that's been helpful. And thank you for watching. <laughs>